There are different TV technologies that affect picture quality in their own way. Competing LCD panel types each offer advantages and disadvantages, and choosing a TV with one over another depends on how you're going to be using the TV. This video looks at the main differences between the two common LCD panel types, IPS and VA, and how they affect the picture quality. Differences Many TV use LCD panels that are lit by LED. There are two popular types of LCD panels, in plane switching, IPS, and vertical alignment, VA, and there are two main differences between each type. A VA panel usually has a high contrast ratio and narrow viewing angles. However, an IPS panel has low contrast and wide viewing angles. These are the main differences between each, and for the most part, panel type doesn't affect other aspects of picture quality like peak brightness, color gamma, or color accuracy. For the purposes of this video, we're going to compare two LED backlit LCD TV, the Sony's 800H, which has an IPS panel, and the Hisense H9G, which has a VA panel. Due to their different panel types, there are three noticeable differences in picture quality, viewing angles, contrast, and black uniformity. So we're going to look at each one. Viewing angle refers to the angle at which you can watch the TV without seeing a noticeable drop in picture quality. IPS TV are the clear winner here, as the image remains accurate when viewing from the side you can see the differences in the videos above. This is their main advantage over VA panels. Most VA panel TV have a noticeable loss in image accuracy when viewing from the side. The narrow viewing angle of VA type TV is also problematic when the TV is used as a PC monitor from up close since the edges of the display look washed out. Contrast ratio is one of the most important factors when it comes to picture quality. It determines how well a TV displays blacks, so one with a good contrast displays deep blacks when viewed in the dark. However, if your TV has a low contrast ratio, you'll notice that blacks look gray when viewed in the dark. VA panels are far superior to IPS panels when it comes to this. So if you tend to watch movies in the dark, you likely want to get a TV with a VA Most TV use VA panels due to this main advantage, and high-end models may have a local dimming feature that further enhances black levels. On the other hand, IPS panels normally have low contrast, so blacks look closer to gray. But you may not notice the difference in contrast in bright environments. In the photo above, the Hisense has a much better contrast ratio. Both photos are set at the same brightness, but the Hisense appears brighter because there's a bigger contrast between its deepest black and brightest white. Our black uniformity tests determine how well a TV displays a dark scene with a bright image in the center. Ideally, you want to see a completely black screen with the center cross being the only part that's lit up, and this is important for people watching movies. No LED TV has perfect uniformity, and unlike viewing angles and contrast, the panel type doesn't completely determine its black uniformity. However, most VA panels that we've tested have good black uniformity, while most IPS panels have subpar black uniformity. This doesn't mean that every VA panel TV has good uniformity, as this can change between units. And you can also improve uniformity using the local dimming feature. As you can see in the pictures above, the Sony has uniformity issues with backlight bleed and clouding throughout. The entire screen also looks blue due to the low contrast ratio. The Hisense screen is much more uniform, and although you can see some backlight bleed along the edges, it disappears if you enable local dimming, as seen in this photo. LCDs function by having liquid crystals in little groups to form the pixel. These crystals react and change position when charged with electricity, and, depending on their position, they allow a certain color of light to pass through. IPS displays have their crystals align horizontally at all time. When charged, they turn to allow light through. VA displays have their crystals align vertically. When charged, they move to a horizontal position, allowing light through, when current isn't sent through them. However, their vertical alignment blocks light far more efficiently, creating better blacks and giving better contrast. There's also another type of IPS panel, called plane to line switching, PLS, which can be seen with the Sony Z. This panel type was designed by Samsung and technically performs the same as an IPS panel. When you compare the pixels visually, IPS panels look like chevrons, VA looks like very straight rectangles, and PLS looks like round edge capsules. Now it's your turn, which one impresses you the most? Let us know in the comment section below. Also, do share and subscribe to our channel for further video notifications.